Hi, I'm Kim McGray, Community Manager for the nonprofit Money Management International, and today is the last day of March. And that also means that tomorrow is the first day of Financial Literacy Month. And I don't need to tell you how important financial literacy is all the time, but it is of particular importance right now because there are so many people who are really struggling um, to manage their money. So our nonprofit created a microsite called financialliteracymonth.com and on the site there are 30 steps to financial freedom. Really simple steps. It's basically a path to take you from April 1st to April 30th with a task per day that at the end of the month you will be far better off financially. Now that doesn't mean you're going to get rich and it doesn't mean that all of your problems are going away. But what it does mean is that you will have created a very firm financial foundation so that you can move forward. This year, um, I invited many wonderful people to participate in Financial Literacy Month in a very unique way. So last year, I actually went through the steps myself and blogged about the process. This year, I've invited different people to blog each day of Financial Literacy Month. So on uh, day one, for example, we have uh, one of the members of the President's Council for Financial Literacy um, kicking us off. And then throughout the month, you'll hear from bloggers and writers and, and financial experts and organizational experts and doctors and, and moms who are basically experts at everything talk about something related to that today's step. So I'm hoping you'll visit often and really take in what these people have to share because they all have a passion for Financial Literacy Month that they want to share with you. So happy spring, happy Financial Literacy Month, and I'll be in touch at the end.